Good morning. It is Saturday, July the 18th. <clears throat> this morning's call to prayer, Open my lips, O Lord, and my mouth shall proclaim your praise. Had you desired it, I would have offered sacrifice, but you take no delight in burnt offerings. The sacrifice of God is a troubled spirit and a broken and contrite heart. O God, you will not despise. The request for presence today. Help us, O God, our Savior, for the glory of your name. Deliver us and forgive us our sins for your name's sake. The greeting today, blessed be the Lord God, the God of Israel, who alone does wondrous deeds, and blessed be his glorious name forever, and may all the earth be filled with his glory. Amen. Amen. The refrain for this morning's lessons, bless the Lord, O my soul, and forget not all his benefits. The gospel reading today, Jesus taught us, saying, Do not store up treasures for yourself on earth, where moth and woodworm destroy them and thieves can break in and steal. But store up treasures for yourselves in heaven, where neither moth nor wormwood destroys them, woodworm destroys them, and thieves cannot break in and steal. For wherever your treasure is, there will your heart be too. Bless the Lord, O my soul, and forget not all his benefits. This morning's psalm. Before the mountains were brought forth, or the land and earth were born, from age to age, you are God. You turn back to dust and say, Go back, O children of the earth, for a thousand years in your sight are like yesterday when it is past, and like a watch in the night. You sweep us away like a dream. We fade away suddenly like the grass. In the morning, it is green and flourishes. In the evening, it is dried up and withered. For we consume away in your displeasure. We are afraid because of your wrathful indignation. Bless the Lord, O oh my soul, and forget not all his benefits. The cry of the church today, O oh God, come to my assistance. O oh Lord, make haste to help me. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us today our daily bread and forgive us our sins as we forgive those who sin against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from the evil one. For yours is the kingdom, the power, and the glory forever and ever. Amen. The prayer appointed for this week, O Lord, mercifully receive the prayers of your servant who calls upon you, and grant that I may know and understand what things I ought to do, and that I also may have the grace and power faithfully to accomplish them. Through Jesus Christ our Lord, who lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. Amen. The concluding prayer of the church today. Lord God, almighty and everlasting Father, you have brought me in safety to this new day. Preserve me with your mighty power that I may not fall into sin nor be overcome by adversity. And in all I do, direct me to the fulfilling of your purpose through Jesus Christ, my Lord. Amen. May God bless you today and always.